On News 12 Connecticut, outrage overnight because the Supreme Court could be edging closer to overturning Roe versus Wade, that landmark case legalizing abortion here in the U.S. decades ago. Politico obtaining a draft majority opinion written by Justice Samuel Alito saying the court will overturn the federal constitutional right to an abortion. That would mean it would be up to states to decide. So the final opinion has not yet been released, so votes could still change before then. A Supreme Court spokesperson is not commenting on the leak this morning. This is also the largest leak in Supreme Court's history. And protesters on both sides of the issue stormed Washington, D.C. as soon as word of the draft opinion broke. This is video of the steps of the Supreme Court. People were out there outraged all night long. Protesters seem very upset. And here in Connecticut, lawmakers recently expanded abortion access ahead of the Supreme Court possibly overturning Roe versus Wade. Governor Ned Lamont reaffirming that stance last night. So check this out, saying, I say it louder and with more resolve than ever before. We will do everything in our power to defend abortion rights here in Connecticut. Similar sentiments from both Connecticut senators this morning. Senator Blumenthal saying countless women are feeling scared and alone, but they should know that this fight is far from over. Congress must harness the anger being expressed and take action. There is no question we must pass the Women's Health Protection Act. It has never been more urgent. And Senator Chris Murphy saying this is devastating news. But remember, in a democracy, no decision is final. Now it's up to us to build a movement that makes sure women, not politicians or governors, Governments control decisions about their bodies and their health care. News 12 is following this story every step of the way on air, on the app, and online. Make sure you have push notifications turned on. We will be updating you all day long there. We have articles like this one, which go into more detail on that political report that broke overnight.